Hey guys, Leon here. So I wanted to do a little bit, uh, do a little video on my fake moon system. So if you guys saw my last video, then you guys know that I recently got an arowana, as in today. So what happened with my last arowana I had was it developed drop eye, which is a symptom where the eye faces downward and looks at the ground, and it can be quite ugly. And this can be caused by a few things. It can be caused by the arowana constantly looking down at the ground, whether or not it's being fed food that's at the ground, or there's lots of commotion at the ground. It can also be caused by uh, high fat foods, where the fat builds up next to the eye. It can also be caused when the arowana bumps its head, and the eye gets um, moved out of place. Um, yeah, so those are the three main causes for a drop eye. And so, I have this lamp here because in my tank eventually there's going to be stingrays. There's already a bitcher. Um, there's one day going to be a red tail cat in there. There's already an eclipse cat, clown knife, iridescent shark. There's plenty of stuff at the bottom, so I want my arowana to have time to look up. So at night I put this CFL bulb, which has almost gone out. It's turning that pink color. So it's not too bright as to light the tank up and make it like day, but it creates this light where when the arowana is swimming at night, it subliminally looks upward at this light. And this will keep the arowana looking up during the night, so even if it's looking down often during the day, it still has that uh, feeling of looking up a lot, and therefore it um, takes away from the cause of drop by. So yeah, this is uh, my fake moon and the, one of the main ways to cure drop eye. So I hope you guys like this video. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.